Hi, I'm Walter and I'm the Dutch Mentor. Are you frustrated? Are you stuck? Are you overwhelmed with all the things that you need to do that leaves barely any time to effectively lead? Have you transitioned into a new role from a technical role to a leading role and not really sure how to proceed? How can I become that high performing leader as I was a high performing doer? Well, you're coming to the right place. Uh, my career started as a paramedic many, many years ago. And as I found my joy for leadership, well, I had some steep learning curves ahead. I was lucky. I found the right mentors along the way who helped me scramble and scratch my way to that valley of despair. When I went from being a technical person to becoming a leader and now in charge of having to oversee people and schedules and manage conflicts and behaviors, I too had a chance. And to do this with somebody who had been there, like a mentor to, from deep experience, was tremendously helpful. And it was helpful because we did it consistently every week for just a few minutes, working together. Now, of course, as I proceeded to my career all the way into the C-suite, I continued to be committed to working with coaches and mentors along the way. It really is no different than being a star athlete going to the Olympics. If you want to get there, you need to get help along the way. You need to know what you know, but even more importantly, you need to know what you don't know. And certainly as an emerging leader, or even as a more senior leader, there's always room for us to continue to learn. And mentorship is the solution to that uh, problem. You know, I've gone to many webinars and conferences along the way, all great events. I love meeting new people and listening to new concepts. The problem is that Monday morning, we have forgotten all about it. We get back into the rut of doing emails but we're not really taking care of the fundamentals of effective leadership. So the master class today is about happy leadership, about learning the fundamentals of servant leadership. It's just a quick intro to kind of give you an understanding what it takes in order to go from where you are today to where you want to be. Uh, you want to be that leader that helps your team thrive and, and leads to high performance. And it leads to a, a nice work-life balance. It gives quality time both at work and at home, and you deserve that. Again, doing it alone is very difficult. As I've experienced it, it is much better to make that small investment in yourself today because it will pay dividends tenfold into the future. And I know I'm always hesitant too to make another investment, especially after these big bills from our bachelor's degrees or our master's degree or even our fellowship. But trust me, and you can see from the testimonials on my website itself, many clients who have taken the leap of faith or making that other, that next level investment in themselves, have found that it really is beneficial. They have found the joy in leading. They have found that they can learn how to build trust and engagement with their team members. It really can lead to quicker promotions and even transition into new industries. It opens up your eyes. And where I focus my time with you is really meeting you in your journey. And it's about self-awareness and self-development Right? It all starts with I. And then we're going to shift to learn how to work in the we. Right? How can we solve problems of root causes? And how can we establish this team operational rhythm that allows you to thrive with your team together? As one, listen, I have worked with difficult groups along the way. And they were highly skeptical of the concepts that I tried to present to them. But once they broke through, once they saw how it worked and they could see that the things that they wanted to do it actually coming to fruition and not only ma we made them happen, but they performed. We were able to compete with some of the largest systems around the, uh, around the nation. That is significant because we do it as a team, right? It is about the we, not the I any longer. It's about outward looking and using your empathy and, and really understanding how to motivate and inspire and sticking to the fundamentals of what true leadership is. What are your true responsibilities? Again, follow through here and watch the masterclass about happy leadership. These are the basic fundamentals, but it also shows you that you have to take action. And as I say in my you know, tagline, you know, just 15 minutes a day, you too can become the leader that you wish you had. And I know for sure that your team would love to have and thrive in. So check out the video. Check out my website at thedutchmentor.com. And at the end, I will give you a quick message on how you get in contact with me. Have a wonderful experience. Be open-minded. 
think outside of the box, and you too can accelerate your career and find that true joy and passion in leading and not just doing and scrambling and feeling you're always working from behind. Have a good day and enjoy. Take care.